Doggy Doesn't Know No by Cindy R. Lee. Sweet little doggy was left on his own. The word no, he was never shown. No one told him what to do to survive. He figured out a way to stay alive. He stole from the trash and drank from the river. The water was dirty and once he ate liver. He slept where the ground was soft and warm. He hid under the bushes when it would storm. When he needed to potty, he'd go by a tree or in the grass where he happened to be. Then one freezing snowy day, Doggy was cold and had no place to lay. Animal welfare pulled up. The man had a treat. He held it out for Doggy to eat. Doggy was scared, but he had no option. He was alone and soon up for adoption. Knowing he was safe, Doggy jumped in the car. The man drove them home. It was really far. When they got to the house, Doggy really had to go. He pottied on the rug and the man said no. He put Doggy out and said, yes, yes, yes. Potty out here where you won't make a mess. Doggy was hungry. He tipped over the trash. Food went flying, crash, crash, crash. His dad said no. His voice was loud. Doggy was confused. His head was bowed. Then his dad sweetly said, this bowl is for you. Eating healthy food is what you should do. Doggy wanted a nap, so he jumped on the chair. His dad said no and gave him a scare. He pulled out a pillow and said, this is best. Here on this bed is where you should rest. I like it here and really want to belong. But everything I do seems to be wrong. This man is teaching me things that are new. No must mean that's not what you do. Accepting no is hard to do, even though it's good for you. Now when daddy says no to me, I bark okay to say I agree. I'm no longer all alone. A deep love my dad has shown. No more no. No more fear. Now good job is all I hear. <laughs>